Hi, I'm Allison Shields, president of Legal Ease Consulting, where I help lawyers create more productive, more profitable, and more enjoyable law practices. I actually had something completely different prepared for my video recording this morning, um, but I decided to ditch it at the last minute. As I am recording this today, we are in the middle of the coronavirus outbreak. And while it is not so bad where I am yet in Suffolk County on Long Island in New York, um, there are places across the world and in the United States where the outbreak is worse. And so one of the things that this brought up for me as I was thinking about it this morning is the idea of resilience. And for some reason since the beginning of the year, this word has become coming back to me over and over again. And resilience is really the idea that um, there's lots of bad things that happen, but resilience is the ability to bounce back from them. And I think it's an important quality and an important thing for all of us to think about whenever we're running into some kind of an obstacle. Now, whether that's a huge obstacle like the coronavirus, which is causing lots of businesses to either slow down or shut down, there are school closings, it has disrupted a lot of lives um, and probably will continue to do so for at least a little while in the future. So uh, what I was thinking about in terms of resilience is how do we react and not panic in the face of an obstacle? So for me personally, I've kind of been bumping up against this idea of resilience since the beginning of the year. Uh, I thought I had some great things planned, um, but Early in January, um, my mom had an accident, which sort of threw off a lot of my business plans and a lot of my personal plans. Uh, some other things have, have happened in the interim. She actually is still in a rehab facility, which now with the coronavirus adds an extra uh, layer of concern. Uh, I'm getting married actually a week from today as I record this, and I'm not sure how this is all gonna affect my wedding. So. I'm trying to think about how to be positive in the face of these issues. And one of the things that has been coming up for me is the idea of community. And so I wanna remind all of you, and again, my audience is pretty much lawyers. So if you're a lawyer, a lot of times you can get isolated if you're a solo, but even if you're in a law firm and you wanna think about the idea of community. Now with this coronavirus, we may be stuck working from home more than we thought. We may not have the automatic community of being in an office or going to a networking event or seeing our friends. And so think about ways that you can continue that community, whether that's making regular phone calls with colleagues and friends or reaching out on social media or by email, um, just to make sure that you don't isolate yourself because I think community is a big part of building that resilience and being able to come back from an obstacle. So I'm not sure if you've got other ideas about how you can be resilient in the face of an obstacle like this. I would love to hear them in the comments to this video. Uh, and in the meantime, until next time, I'm Allison Shields, president of Legal Ease Consulting. Thank you, and don't forget to wash your hands.